In this video, I'll show you how to hide the country field in your WooCommerce checkout in just a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Okay, so throughout this video, I'm going to show you how to remove the country section, which we can see here. So I'm going to show you how to customize your checkout from having these fields to completely hide in the field. We can rearrange a section as well. We can add additional fields or message to our checkout. OK, so I'll just show you how you can customize and just enhance the entire um, checkout experience for your customers. OK, and we'll be using the all in one at checkout plugin. So just head over to all in one at checkout dot com. So with this particular plugin, we can actually rearrange the checkout fields visually as well. We can add um, upsells and so much more okay so i'll leave the link in the description below and with that said let's head over to our dashboard and let's get started okay so assuming you've downloaded the all-in-one at checkout plugin by WeSuite, go ahead and upload that plugin so we'll go plugins add new go ahead and upload and install the plugin once you've done so you'll see this we suite menu here from here you just want to navigate to activate then it'll automatically redirect you to this add-on section Okay, and then from here, we can scroll down to where it says all in one at checkout and we just want to make sure we enable these modules. Okay, so I've got a free version and a pro version active. Okay, so with that being said, let's navigate to AIO checkout for all in one at checkout. Okay, and now we just need to go ahead and create a new checkout. Okay, so we just click create new checkout here. Since I've already created one, I'll show you how I've actually edited this one. Okay. OK, so just a quick overview, if you want to add new fields to this checkout, just click this settings icon here and then you can drag and drop the different fields onto the page and rearrange them. OK, so I'm going to remove this field. So here we can see the state slash country and we can remove both these fields. OK, so we can just click this eye icon here and then this will just hide it on the front end. OK, so if you want it as well, so let's say we wanted to display the country, we can click this settings icon. And then maybe let's say we're only shipping to um, customers within the US, then we can just have the US as the default option, okay? Or we can remove it um, entirely, it's totally up to you. Okay, so once you've configured your field settings, we just need to navigate to design here. And then we can choose um, whether we want to use our theme default template or one of our custom templates, it's totally up to you. There will be more templates added in the future as well. So I'm just going to select this two column template here and I'm going to select this modern design. So now we'll just navigate to settings. We just want to make sure we enable this option and we can set it as our global checkout as well. OK, for the name, we'll just give it a name. It's just for internal purposes. The slug will leave it at blank and it'll automatically generate the slug. OK, and um, so where it says applies to, we get to choose who we want this checkout to display to. So we can set it to everyone, a customer with a particular user role, a particular user and it gets users okay so which is users logged out of your site okay we can customize the pay button and we can automatically close this checkout based on certain conditions again it's not relevant for this video so we'll just skip past it um, where it says enable address auto complete you've got the option to integrate google auto address complete api so it just speeds up the checkout process for your customers okay so i'll leave a link on screen and in the description below to a video showing you how to actually utilize this particular feature okay but now we can just go ahead and click save changes okay and when we view our shop page okay let's navigate to the checkout page and then here we can see our um, checkout design if you can remember, we kept this country field here and then we specified United States as the default. But if we wanted to remove it completely, we can just go ahead and click this eye icon here. Let's hit save changes. And now when we refresh this page, it's no longer there, okay? And that's a quick and simple way to hide the country field on your WooCommerce checkout in just a few simple steps. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave in a comment box below or reach out to support and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.